OK, well, uh, Woking have just beaten Gloucester 4-3 away and uh, what was... I described, I was doing the co-commentary and at times I said it's almost like a Fred Carno football game. It was quite a bizarre game in many ways, wasn't it? Yeah, it was, uh, it was not ideal, um, <laughs> you could say that. Um, we had a spell of about 10 minutes where we looked like under 12s, we were all over the place. They got their three goals and, and it, was a, it was a big uphill battle from there. Um, but excellent spirit to, to come back and get the win. Uh, and it's brilliant to score the winner late on as well. Um, I'll tell you that all day. Um, so, yeah, good spirit. Um, didn't think we deserved anything performance-wise, but good to get the three points, get out of here and go home. And after a, a, a sort of draining, probably emotionally as well as physically, game on Saturday, we actually started pretty comfortably, I would say, in the first half hour, particularly when we went 1-0 up. You thought, yeah. that's a, you know, we're getting control of the game here. Yeah, yeah, I agree. We, we had a good half an hour. Um, we probably, when we scored, thought we were going to go on and get two or three, so a bit of complacency probably stepped in, and we take a lot of lessons from that and, and learn um, in the future games not to, to take our head off the game and, and think we've already won it when there's still 60, 70 minutes to go. So a lot of learnings from today, but um, yeah, brilliant to get the three points. And Gloucester, on the attack, they had a little bit of pace and they had two or three quite clever little players, didn't yep. they? Yeah, they kept two up there at all times. Um, they made the defenders think a lot. Um, but yeah, they, they seemed to tire late on and, and we seemed to take the upper hand and, and I think the uh, added fitness that we've been doing with Martin and Ian helped when it comes to it. And uh, second half, so 3-2, having had a crazy first half, it seemed to be sort of petering out yeah. when... Uh, I, th I think it was before that the referee tried to send off a play who hadn't been booked twice, <laughs> yeah. and then and then out of nowhere, sort of Max Max seems to have a knack of getting these sort of goals, doesn't he? Yeah, it was a, it was an interesting night all round. Uh, a sending off that was was his first yellow card, a four three result, own goals all over the place. It was a it was a strange strange night. Um, but yeah, Max Max done brilliantly chasing down all game. It wasn't just uh, for the goal that he, he scored from the keeper's mistake. It was it was all game, and, and he fairly deserved that goal because of the hard work that he put in. I think chasing the keeper late to make him force that mistake just sums that up how he played. And the fourth goal, Jack. Some people have been saying. I think the comment I was co-commentating. Yeah. So, the so you got it said, right. Didn't so you? Jack, he, said, he said Jack Cook scored. <laughs> yeah. And uh, I, I hadn't got a clue. I'd lost, sort of lost it by then. It was just a Who's bewildering. Yeah. It was just a bewildering game. But I don't know why it's being questioned. I'm completely honest. <laughs> I have no idea. As I I've, came off, others said it's an own goal. Which, to be honest, most of your teammates are saying as well. I don't. Go, no, I don't agree. I think it was. Um, Did yeah. you actually touch it? I yeah yeah yeah. yeah. <laughs> Clear, clear touch into the top corner. Um, I'll take the goal. That's my third of the season now. So uh, brilliant. Yeah, we'll, we'll we'll see. Once it goes in the books, as will a four three win. And I think the final thing I want to say is that, regardless of the performance, you know, and, uh, and so on, it does show this team's full of spirit and fight. Yeah. Really. Yeah. I mean, we've had two uh, long trips in the same week. You could say. Um, so we we've done brilliantly to get a win in the FA Cup and the three points here tonight. You would have you would have taken um, taken that at the start of the week, and uh, we're just yeah really proud to get the win uh, and get on out of here. Brilliant, thanks, thanks, Jack. On to Slough, yes. AstroTurf. Yeah, yeah, it'll be interesting. I know Martin's uh, really doesn't like the AstroTurf, so it'll be good to get in his reaction before the game. But <laughs> <laughs> yeah, brilliant. Well done, and safe trip home.